I mean, I think everybody know by now that Bali is my favorite island and that I come here more than three times a year. And yeah, this time has been amazing. Unfortunately, the weather was not on my side, but you know, Bali is Bali. I went to Monkey Safari in Ubud. Uh, they were quite scary, but I, at least I have a good Instagram photo. Katamama is my favorite hotel and uh, it was amazing when I post a photo of I could have uh, you know all this set up CDJs and stand table and mixer and speaker in my room they were like what and more and all the DJ were writing comments something like a uh, more they should do this more often every hotel and I'm doing a recording for RA um, and I was supposed to deliver by this month and as soon as I arrived in Bali I was like, I'm gonna do it but Bali is one of those islands that makes you like, tomorrow, I'll do it tomorrow, yeah, I'll do it tomorrow. So I ended up doing it yesterday. The Peggy Shoe story has started in Glastonbury. All of a sudden people were calling Peggy Shoe with the sh one shoes in the air. And I was like, Arthur, what's, why are they doing that? And Arthur was like, I've been to Glastonbury for many times, but I've never seen something like this in my life. So I'm like, I'm sure they don't know my name. You know, and then they were like, Peggy Chu, Peggy Chu, Peggy Sue, Peggy who? You know, like they were saying everything. Um, I still don't know why they did it, who started it. But now they say hi to me with the shoe in the air and everywhere. It happened in Jakarta too. Let's see if, if it happens tonight too. <laughs> um, 2018, I'll be focusing on developing myself. In music wise and everything so if I did like almost 170 gigs in 2017 I'm gonna reduce to half and I'm trying to uh, take a lesson with like more vocals and more, more instrumental and um, yes I need to draw more I used to draw a lot but recently I haven't had time so I always take my sketchbook and my pen and my coloring pencil on the plane but I ended up always falling asleep, so I haven't done any drawing for a while, but I will do that in 2018. The thing is, I studied piano when I was eight, but there was a long gap when I moved to London, my guardian did not buy me a piano. So there was like seven years of gap that I haven't played any piano. So once I started production again, I tried to come back, but learning how to play Chopin and Beethoven doesn't really help. So I am still, I haven't been in lesson for a while, I'm taking a lesson, jazz piano lesson. So because I learned it before, it's easier for me to play jazz, it's easier for me to learn, but um, I'm still learning jazz chord and jazz chord is really helpful when you want to make music. Larry is one of my favorite he hero, I think, like to, many of us you know if i listen to his music his music tells me i need to learn more basically i want to i would love to make a music like him he's kind of person who can make basically everything you know like 95 chill out bpm to house music to amazing techno um i am thinking i'm gonna go and hear him tonight for one hour and i'm gonna check because i can proudly say I know most of his music because I'm a big fan and then I will see if, if he doesn't play some tracks that I would like to play I will play it and I'm prepared for tonight I'm gonna wear a Larry Heard t-shirt <laughs> the guy from Sub Club gave it to me and you know, it says Larry Heard and he's like a him with a keyboard like that <laughs> so, yeah. uh, my new EP is coming out in February in 2018 on Ninja Tune I haven't done any EPs in 2017. Um, I haven't been in studio for a while. As for, for many time, I've been working on remixes, but I haven't worked on any EP. But luckily, I was managed to I managed to finish EP by in, in November, and it's gonna be out in February. And I'm a bit excited, but also a bit shy because it's gonna be a. I try to make something different, and I'm actually singing in Korean, so. I don't know how people's reaction will be, but it's something I wanted to do, so yeah. Well, I'm planning to do my own label, I'm planning to do my own party, and I might be able to open my new brand, so yeah.
on party, on label, on brand. Yeah.